Welcome back everyone to another video of Bug Boys. And here we're gonna show you this RGO spider. It's our pet. And he's a young one. Not fully grown, but we're gonna feed it these larvae. It's a really interesting experience seeing it wrap its prey. Yeah. And you see that zigzag? Like that's how they that's how you can know it's also RGB spider because like they have like the zigzag web they do in the middle of their web. That's really cool. And it's probably gonna attack fast too. So be quick. See look at that. Oh. Look at it, right with spray. Look at it. See look how fast it's doing it. If you they got, do it very fast, like and precise. Very efficient. Did he take a bite into it? Oh, I think he took a bite into it. Look at him. Oh, you can see the web coming out of its ottoman. And it's so, they, sometimes they do this vibrating thing. Is when they feel threatened, they vibrate to make themselves look invisible so the predator can't see it. Well, the cis larvae has no chance for this RGOB spider. Ooh, it took a bite into it. And that venom was working into it. Oh my gosh, it's wrapping it so much. He also shed his skin not too long ago. It's on the ground. On the yeah, you right. see that skin right there? Yeah, it's his skin. Gotta shed it. Oh. Yeah, this uh, this is actually one of my favorite spiders. Because, like, I love the stripe on them, the how they build their webs. And when they're big, it's not going to be, like, this color, but it's going to be more yellow, yellowy. We're going to have, like, a bright yellow color to it. And I think this spider that we collected, we actually found it in our garden. And I'm pretty sure it came from, like, we before we had a adult RGOP spider. And it laid an egg sac, egg sac, and the babies hatched out of it. And I, I'm pretty sure this is one of the babies of it. Because it was, like, literally right near right near a garden. It's actually right near that tree. That tree over there. You guys can see that? That tree. It laid out. It laid the adult, or we related on that one. And it's starting to eat it now. And it's doing that, see? see they do that vibrating thing. See how it's shaking? Oh my gosh. So smart spiders. Oh, oh, spiders are smart. Wow. So amazing. Don't you guys think? Isn't this a wonderful spider, guys? Yeah. I would, I would really like to see you guys have a pet. RGOB spider. Because these spiders are amazing. And the color is just... Booming. I'll show you guys in a different angle. Oh, that's the front of it. See that? As yellow. Is it called a yellow garden spider? Actually. Yeah, not an old reaver. You see that yellowy on it? But it's also called RGOP spider. They have different names to them. Yeah. It's such amazing to see and see it attack its prey. Oof, is this amazing. They're good to have in your garden because they eat any pest insects in your garden. Yeah. They'll eat flies. Like many flying insects at this age, small flies and stuff. When they get older, they could eat butterflies, some 
beneficial insects, but they could also eat larvae. Lar they eat many flying insects. Yeah. And they had to do it quick when they, once the, like, the, in, the prey goes on their web, they got to attack it as fast as they can before it escapes. But they'll eat many different kind of insects. Like this larvae right here. It's like munching on it. I'm going to try to show you guys the jaws of this wonderful old weaver. I mean, not old weaver. Gardener spider or RDOP. Hard to get a clear view of that, guys. I'm sorry. But this is the container we have it in. This container right here. They'll also eat beetles. That some species of beetles are pests, so they'll eat those too. Close up view of it eating. See that, guys? You can see the larvae moving. Like, it's, it's using its fangs, and while the fang is moving, the larvae is moving. This is just amazing. I just can't wait until it's adult. It'll be bright yellow. Well, hopefully. We're gonna try to breed it if we can, but like, we're probably gonna actually release it, release into our garden. And hopefully, it mates with a male or a female. I'm not sure. We're not sure if it's a female or male. We actually don't know how to identify it if if it's a female or a male. Actually, the males are smaller. They're like. Do they have pedal pumps? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think but the males like are really tiny. Pedibles. They're tiny, like, and the females like way bigger than the male. Yeah, we're gonna just probably show you guys as a when it's the adult, we'll show you guys. But look how amazing that is. Look how the legs are. They're like spread out as an X shape. Look at that. Such an amazing, beautiful spider. As you can see, the larvae is dead now. Yeah, this is what the RDOP spider does. It's thing. This is every time we. This, this happens all the time when we feed it. So, yeah. Let me show you in a different angle. Look at that, so amazing. There's different kind of species of these sp spiders. But this is like my one of my favorite ones. Oh yeah, I think that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Le leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. We are out.